what's going on? This is Jordan Wagner with PremierGuitar.com here to tell you about the new Orange TH30 head. Now the TH30 is a new two-channel amp from Orange. It's powered by four EL84 power tubes. It's 30 watts and just like a real orange it is loud, crunchy, and punchy. The clean channel on it has a two-band EQ, treble, and bass. Then there's a volume control. And it has that really tight low end that's normally associated with non-master volume amps. A very immediate percussive attack to it. Uh, lots of headroom. And very, very sensitive to uh, pick attack and your playing style. Now the cab I'm playing through today is an orange PPC 4x12. Hefty orange 412 cabinet. Um, and the guitar I'm playing today is a Godin Session, made in Canada. Dirty Channel is also really great too. I love it. Uh, it's completely different though as far as the voicing goes and the feel and the uh, just, just the overall response of the amp. Um, it's a lot softer on the top end overall. You can get some really, really cutting tones out of it, but it's not as percussive on the high, high end frequencies. Uh, and it has tons of gain like massive amounts of it, you know, perfect for stoner metal playing in the vein of like High on Fire or Wake or Weed Eater or any of those types of bands. <laughs> Unlike the clean channel, which had a single volume control, the dirty channel has a, not, has a uh, master volume setup uh, with gain and a master volume and a shape control uh, that kind of acts as, it, it kind of cycles through the different frequencies right there so you can get kind of a, a tone with a lot of the highs rolled off or you can add more high end to it if you wish. <laughs> Now the TH30 is a 30 watt head. You can knock it down to 15 watts by flipping the standby switch to half, or you can put it back to the normal setting of 30 watts with the full position there. <laughs> The back of the amp has some features too. Um, standard series effects loop, jack four foot switch for channels, uh, three speaker outs, and a really cool feature to knock two of the power tubes out of the circuit. So you're effectively knocking the uh, wattage down as well. With this down to two output tubes and the front switch down to half, the amp is right around seven watts total. Now the TH30 is a great amp. I found it really hard to find anything about it that I didn't like. Um, the one thing that I had kind of a qualm with was the volume balancing. You really, really, really have to push the, the master volume on the dirty channel to match the same amount of volume and punch as the clean channel. 
And that could have something to do with the, with the different voicing. Uh, and the clean channel is very, it, it's, it's very differently voiced. So you can see here on the clean channel volume, I have it at about 9.30, 9 o'clock, somewhere around there. In order to get the same amount of volume and punch out of the dirty channel, I had to have it pushed up to about 12.30 or 1.00. Uh, if I wanted to have it go a little bit over the clean channel, I had to have it cranked up to about 2 o'clock um, with the clean channel volume in that position. Now, this isn't so, mu so much of a detriment because Orange was, was good enough to include separate volumes for each channel, so you could balance the volume in, bet in between the two. Um, other than that, the amp is just sounds and feels great to play. So there you have it. That is the Orange TH30 head. You can read my full review online in the December edition of PremierGuitar.com and also the new December issue. Uh, pricing on the head right now is $11.99 for the head, and there's also a 1x12 combo version that is $13.49. Go check it out. It's a killer amp. This is Jordan Wagner, and you're watching PremierGuitar.com.